A weekend is always a big one here with several large events drawing crowds. Atlanta News First Yasmin Olson is in downtown near Andrew Young International Boulevard and Cortland Street where there are already costumes everywhere for Dragon Con. And this is just one of the many events happening this weekend in downtown Atlanta. So you're going to see a lot of people in their costumes in this area. I'm Con. here for Dragon Con. Yes, we are first timers. Uh, very excited. Savannah Late Fox and her husband came from Texas to Atlanta for Labor Day weekend. And in this city, Labor Day weekend also means Dragon Con. I am inspired by the Haunted Mansion ride at Disney World. So it's my favorite. This one event alone had over 65,000 people last year and will surely attract the same big numbers this year. Oh my gosh, just seeing like all of the people and going, oh, they're inspired by this or they they look like that and just, you know, it's, it's a bunch of adults being nerds. This is always a big weekend for the city with people crowding downtown Atlanta for several events. Hospitality at the hotels and like the restaurants and stuff like that. I mean, we know it's a lot of stress on them because it's so many people at once, but everybody's always so nice and so friendly. It's also Atlanta Black Pride weekend with a festival, parties and more. And then at the Mercedes Benz Stadium, the Georgia Clemson game on Saturday. So don't be surprised if you see a lot of tailgating. And with those things happening, it obviously means only good news for tourism in the city. We stopped at Centennial Olympic Park, where they just finished updating their visitor center right in time for weekends like this. We have a team in the visitor center that kind of helps people find their way. Ken Stockdell with the Georgia World Congress Center Authority showed us around, pointing out how this park connects the crowds of people here for all different things. This will be kind of the place where everybody mixes. Um, before the game starts. And Atlanta police remind drivers to be patient and to expect road closures beginning tomorrow morning when the Dragon Con parade begins in downtown Atlanta. Yasmina Alston, Atlanta News First. And we're just getting started on this. So mm -hmm. here's a look at the cluster of hotels in downtown Atlanta showcasing Dragon Con through Monday. The Westin, the Marriott Marquis, the Hyatt, the Hilton, and Cortland plus America's Mart. Tomorrow's Dragon Con Parade is the big event in the same area. It will start at 10 a.m. at North Avenue and Peachtree and then work its way.